Stay with her when she gets up one. That's nice. Okay, one, hold your Someone shot. Someone else. That's nice. Very nice. Stay tight. Who is it? Tell me. Oh, Rand. I didn't want you to find out this way. I didn't want to hurt you. Cut, please. Very nice, everybody. We're on our way out. Okay, we're set. All right. Uh, let's get a tail plate. I'll pull that yeah. down some. Knock him out for me. Give me John. Sylvia! That was terrific. Do you think so? No, I, I think I was too held back. No, 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 no. You were fine. You were afraid to tell him. You think you still love him. Held back is good. Uh, I don't know. You think we ought to do another one? She feels if like... Sylvia's it. uncomfortable, absolutely. Let's go. All right, let's go from the top, everybody, please. Number one. When are you leaving? Right after this. And I wish you were coming with me. We have so much fun when we go away together. I know. I wish I could go, too, but there's no way. I've got so much work to do. Well, couldn't you bring your laptop and work by the car? <laughs> Are you kidding? Nobody works right, in reset. Vegas. We're going to go again right away. Listen, we'll go away together next weekend, all right? Ted! Yeah, already working on it. No, come here. Come what? Here. Hey, there's a plane down near San Diego. Oh, no. Oh, really? No survivors. God, it's going to be one of those days. Now, come on. This is fun. Remember? OK, get everything you can on the plane crash. Obviously, mm -hmm. that's our lead. See if Rico and Stan are available. If not, just talk to Norman in San Diego. Got it. You going to Vegas, too? No, I have to work. Yeah. Well, I don't know if Sylvia puts up with you. I don't know. It's see you later. Are you feeling all right? You look like hell. I know. I think I'm coming down with the flu. Uh, it's really bad timing because I have this party to go to with people from Bradley, Stevenson, and Ugh. I'll bring you some tea. Where will you be? In the editing room. Meet you there. God, I can't believe it. My new suit. Take it to the dry cleaners tomorrow. It's red wine, Adrian. It's not going to come out. Damn kid. Kids should not be allowed at a business party. It's inexcusable. When I was her age, I was in bed by seven, or there was hell to pay, and my old man had no time for any excuses either. Believe me. She's a really cute little girl. Yeah, I'm sure she is. I'm just glad she belongs to someone else. What's that supposed to mean? It means that I am glad that we are not having any kids. That's what it means. You know, Stephen, someday you're just going to have to deal with what happened to you in your childhood. What are you talking about? I'm talking about all your bad, pent-up feelings about the way you were raised that come out every time you see some little innocent kid. That's what I'm talking about. So I had a rotten childhood. So did a lot of people. It's got nothing to do with who I am now, Adrian. Oh, really? Well, you just made a fool of yourself in front of the people you must want to...